Hey guys, welcome back to Chord Hub and today I am going to teach you the chords of the song Spectre Mills and before anything else, if you haven't already subscribed to my channel please click the subscribe button and notification bell below because every day I am going to upload a new tutorial and for this tutorial guys, I am going to simplify all the bar chords and later on I am going to teach you the strumming pattern of this song, okay? So for uh, intro, we're going to have a B minor so by the way guys, the actual chords of this from the original uh, recording is uh, 1 fret higher which of course is a C minor, okay? But enable for us to have an easier chord set, we move it down to a B minor, 1 fret lower, okay? But for those of you who really wanted to play this in the original key, you can just add a key over here and all the chords that I am going to teach you are still the same. So for intro guys, we'll only have one chord, the B minor chord, okay? But we're going to simplify this one into this. Okay, starting here at the B bass, second fret of the uh, fifth string, second fret of the uh, first string, and third fret of the second string, okay? And then go like this. Okay, and then verse. This one over here is a G major 7, okay? The simplified version of G major 7. Because the actual G major 7 is just like this. Okay? So the simplified is this one. Starting here at the 6th fret of the 3rd fret of the 6th string, and then here, 3rd fret of the 2nd string, and 1st string, 2nd fret. But you can also just play this with a G chord, okay? So we will also gonna use a G minor. Okay, for the verse, okay, and chorus. So the G minor is just like this, but we're going to simplify it to this one. Starting here at the G bass, and then third fret of the uh, third and second string. Okay, and then and just mute the other three strings, okay? Just focus on this one, two, and three. Of course, we're also gonna use this an F sharp minor. So they have the same formation for the G minor, from the G minor, okay? So we just move it down to here. And we have an F sharp minor. Okay, so for the verse, this and then E minor, G minor, and then. To have this, this okay. second verse. So starting here at the uh, ninth fret of the fifth string, down to seven and five and fifth. Okay. Okay, but you can al also just ignore this uh, guitar line and just focus on the B minor and then second verse. So for the second verse. And then this time, just uh, put this away. A G minor and F sharp minor. Back to G major seven, and this time an E. It and proceed to chorus. A E minor and A. Okay, so you can actually use a, a, an F sharp minor like this or this. Okay, so for chorus, we're going to uh, be using an F sharp minor with this. Okay, with this kind. Starting here at the F sharp bass to second fret with the fifth string, sorry, sixth string, and second fret with the fourth and third string. And you can play out play it all the way down. Okay, again for uh, chorus. And then 
and back to intro. So this one is an F sharp bass, an uh, F sharp. So we're going to simplify this into this. Starting here at the second fret of the second string, third fret of the third string, and fourth fret of the fourth string. Okay. Spectrum means then intro. So for the intro, guys, after the first chorus, we're going to have this pattern. So B minor. Then this one, this is a G, okay, but instead of this one, we're going to use this, so starting here the second fret of the second string, and then G B, okay, just these two, and then an A sustain, and an A, so again for the uh, E draw. So after the second chorus, guys, we back again to that intro, okay? And then we proceed now to the bridge. So for bridge, we're going to use a additional bar chord, which is the C minor. Okay, so the simplified version of this is just this one. Okay, starting here at the third fret of this uh, fifth string. Sorry, and then third fret of the uh, third string and second fret. Sorry, fourth fret of the second string. And again, just mute the other three strings. Okay. Next, we're also gonna use an A slash uh, sorry C sharp. This is like this. Okay, this is actually just an A chord, but instead of an A bass, we're going to have an F. C sharp bass. So position your hands like this. But if you're having a hard time doing this, you can just actually play this with an A chord. Okay, so for bridge. And then a C minor. And after this, we're going to have the ad lib. So for ad lib, we're going to have an additional. Uh, bar chord which is this uh, G sharp minor just like this starting here at the fourth fret of the uh, sixth string and then fourth fret of the fourth and third string okay so and then C sharp C sharp is just like this but you can actually have its power chord which is just this two. okay starting here at the fourth fret of the uh, fifth string and Sixth fret of the third, uh, sorry, fourth string. So for ad lib, G minor, start by G minor. And an F, and then a G sharp minor. And then C sharp. Okay, back to B minor. And then verse again. So for the strumming pattern guys, it is advisable for beginners that we all use a downward stroke just like this. Because eventually our strumming skills will develop on its own. But for a more advanced way of strumming this, so the pattern guys is down, 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 up, down, 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 up. Okay, that's the whole cycle and connect it to the chord. So again, down, down, up, down, up, down, 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 up, down, down, up, down, up, down, 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 up, down, 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 up, down, up, down, 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 up. Okay. And that's it guys for the course of this song and I hope you like the tutorial. Thank you!